My name is Kristen Montgomery. I'm from Lancaster, Wisconsin, and I'm a Spanish education major with minors in French and teaching English as a second language. Currently, I'm a non-traditional student here at UW-Platteville. Um, I graduated in 2010 with a degree in Spanish and a minor in French. My original plan was to attend grad school. Unfortunately, um, around the first semester of grad school, I ended up getting sick. Um, I was ill for about three or four years. I ended up having a couple heart surgeries, so I kind of had to reevaluate my life plan. So once I was healthy enough to return to school, I decided to come back to UW Platteville to get my teaching certification. I have known Dr. Spoto for years. He was my first Spanish teacher here at UW Platteville. I had him from intermediate Spanish up to advanced courses. In fact, most of my degree courses were with Dr. Spoto. So he's a professor that I greatly respect and admire. Um, he taught me so much more, you know, that I can possibly express. He thought that I was worthy enough for his scholarship. Um, it means so much to me, especially since I've had to spend a lot of my own personal finances paying for multiple heart surgeries. Scholarships mean a great deal to me. It's the difference between quitting and continuing my education, so I'm so grateful. Hi, I'm Missy Lipska. I'm the Annual Giving and Donor Relations Officer for UW-Platteville. Dr. Spoto retired from UW-Platteville in 2016 after a 49-year career in teaching Spanish. He is obviously very invested in creating opportunities for the future generations because even after dedicating his entire career to higher education, he wanted to provide another way to continue to make a difference for students. Dr. Spoto decided to establish a scholarship to support continuing students majoring in the humanities. His generosity led to his membership in the 1866 Cornerstone Society as an associate member in both 2017 and 2018. I'm uh, Raymond Spoto. I was previously, as of two years ago, a professor of Spanish at the University of wisconsin Platteville. I think the heart of a university is in the humanities and the general education requirements in general. That I call education for life. If you talk about inspiring students, I would say students inspire me when they come to class prepared and they ask questions and want to know things. And want to that makes me want to go that extra mile and dig deeper. She was a, an excellent student. She always uh, and was, was a happy learner, I would say. She enjoyed learning and came to class, you know, enthusiastic and asked questions. And, and uh, I felt that that's the kind of student who will continue to learn. It's really neat to have watched Dr. Spoto and Kristen kind of come full circle, going from a professor and student relationship to a donor and scholarship recipient relationship. And it's almost as if Dr. Spoto is kind of handing off the baton to Kristen as she now pursues her education to be able to start her career teaching Spanish just like Dr. Spoto did for 49 years at UW-Platteville. For many UW-Platteville students, scholarships and financial aid may make the difference between being able to continue their education or not. Kristen has been through a lot and she is very determined to become a teacher so that her future is a stable, healthy, and secure one. And I know it's really special to her to have received this support from her previous professor. The impact of support of the 1866 Cornerstone Society is so very powerful for the students of UW-Platteville today and for years to come. We are so thankful to the members of this society and to all of our loyal supporters because their generosity is providing students like Kristen the opportunity to build a bright future. Bueno, Kristen, mucho gusto hablar contigo, que te vayas bien, muy simpático.